evening and welcome to the Baby Bunting Facebook Live series. Series two, episode 49. My name's Rochelle, I'm a product manager and Steelcraft brand advocate. And tonight I really wanna take you through the amazing new 1-2 V2 stroller. I'm gonna take you through its features, its benefits, um, also its compatibility with the um, baby capsules, but also some of the accessories that you can buy separately. What is super exciting is that tonight we are offering for you to win or have a chance of winning your very own 1-2-V2. Now all you have to do is just pop into the comments one of the amazing features that I talk about. So good luck and it's valued at 499, Best Buy 499 exclusive to Baby Bunting. Now, if you have any other questions about the products that I haven't gone through yet, we have one of our steel craft experts here with us tonight who is going to answer all of your questions. So don't be afraid, and if you've got any questions, please reach out. Now, I'm gonna introduce you to our brand. Now, the Steelcraft brand is extraordinary because it's founded in 1947, so that's over 70 years of experience. And it was founded by a man, Colin M. Johnson. Now, Colin was a, a father-to-be, so his wife was expecting, and he built a pram, not something not unlike this one over here. And when we look at it, it does have similarities to the 1-2-V-2. You know, this is quite quite amazing. We have a long history and Colin M. Johnson's you know, legacy that he left behind was to offer solutions to families that were affordable and really were feature full. And so tonight we're going to take you through those features. First off, what we have is the 1-2-V-2 in single mode. Now this means that it's suitable for new parents and expecting parents. But also what you see on this side is is it in its tandem mode and so you can see that this is for growing families as well. What we really love about this product is that it has so much features. You've got the bassinet and so this is a convertible seat and it is a bassinet mode but it can also transition to the seat later on so you don't have to buy an extra accessory. What we have included is a bassinet liner and inside here you'll just see our little friend Emily, now she is a doll, but I wanted to show you the bassinet liner is a beautiful soft fabric. It has a belly strap to just position your little one so that when you're actually going up a curb mount, so you can imagine, it just really puts her into the position so she doesn't slide up and down the bassinet. Now this bassinet liner is created from a fabric that has been tested to a international standard to really protect your little ones to ensure that there are no chemicals that are harmful. So this is the newborn position. It has a really firm mattress in, inside here, which is really good for sleeping. Gives you that lay flat position, which is suitable for a newborn. Um, up until, from newborn up until about um, six months, which is about nine kilos. Now we're just gonna take Emily out of here because to convert it as she grows, I'm just gonna pop her over into the seat. Now to convert this into the seat, it's super simple. You've just got a zip, so you just undo the lining here. And we're just gonna remove this little bit of elastic here. And you can see that's the inside of the seat. Now, to transfer that into a seat, we have two buckles either side. So you just lift those up and you're just going to click that buckle up. And then the only other thing that you have is just a strap at the back and you just pull that as tight as possible and then just thread that through and back on itself so you don't have that dangling. We have beautiful leatherette detailing. Now this leatherette is really great because it is highly durable but easy to clean. So keeping that really clean for your little ones. You've got a pivot handlebar. So this pivots like this getting your baby in and out. 
You also have a recline position so you've got a little lever at the back here and you can lever it down, I just skipped one of those, into any position. So this is parent facing and this is the stage when they're really young. You have them in that full recline when their neck isn't strong enough but as their neck gets stronger you can position them up into an upright position. But they don't like looking at you forever. So what we have, two buttons on either side, you just lift that up and then you can turn the seat around. Now, world facing, this is as they get older, they want to explore the world and they start learning. And that's looking out at the world and learning. We have a huge canopy and this is at its full extension, so the zipper has already been released. We have quiet magnetic closures and also a mesh viewing window. Now that doubles to allow air ventilation through. Pop that back down. So you can see, visor, huge canopy, giving lots and lots of protection. You can zip this up. Uh, the zip is on this side. Really simple. Now, handlebars. We have two, there's two different types of handlebars in the market, and I guess I really want to talk about the differences. So there's telescopic, and to make that taller, it comes out further, so it makes your product longer. But a pivot handle has some added benefits. Obviously, you can pivot it to be up high, but you're not lengthening the product. And also, you can pivot down low for those people who are a bit shorter. What I really like about it is when it's up high in this position, rather than manoeuvring your product, and I'm just going to release the brake, like this, when you've got two children in your stroller and you've got to push around a really heavy weight, what you can do is hold it from the side and use your arm to get the force to turn like that. So you can see that a pivot handle has some additional benefits. What else have we got? We have the huge basket and I am going to take this seat off just so that you can see because it is a 12 kilogram capacity weight but look at that volume and you can imagine what you can fit in there. You can fit a whole nappy bag and some groceries in that big space which is really great. Pop the seat back on. And then we'll talk about suspension. We have all wheel suspension. There's suspension at the back in here. It's a bit hard to see, but you can see here is some of the suspension. I can try and push down and you see some movement. And then when I look at the front, we have suspension in the front wheel also. The wheels are made out of a light foam, which means that this product is one of the lightest single and tandem strollers in the market. Like it's 10.8 kilos. The seat itself has a suitability from newborn, which we showed you, up until 20 kilos, which is approximately four years of age. All right, so we've gone through most of the um, features. I'm just going to quickly show you how to fold it. Now you can fold it with the seat on or with the seat off and it's really simple. You have two triggers, one on either side and you're just going to lift them up and push. Let that just fall down. What you have over here is a handle and you just lift this handle and you can hear it click. So that's the little frame lock, which I'm just gonna turn it around and show you. It's just over here. So to release it, all you need to do, if I come around this side, we're gonna push that, let it drop out, and then just lift up. So it's super easy. And that's what I love about the 1-2 V2. It is designed for simplicity. So, this is single mode and you saw the bassinet. We also have, obviously, the seat this way without the bassinet mode that's suitable for newborn. And then we also have the baby capsule. So we're gonna take the top seat off. What we have done is to make life easy is what we have included into the pack is the click and go adapters. Designed with a little dot on the adapter and on the frame so that it's easy to make sure that you've got the right one in on the right side. And click that into place and then taking our Brightax Unity Baby Capsule, all you need to do is click in like that.
And so that's a newborn solution as well. Great for easy transitions. If you've got two children, it's really beneficial because you can just take your baby straight from the car to the stroller while you're managing your other little toddler because that's about the convenience. So that's the, the, the 1-2-V-2 um, in its single mode. Now we go to tandem. So this, you can see the difference. Very, very small footprint, which means that it's easy to manoeuvre. The second seat is suitable from newborn, which is really great because you can actually have your newborn down here and your toddler up here, or you can have it vice versa. But this one is up to 15 kilos, which means it's approximately three years of age. Also, you can have twins. You can have a capsule, baby, baby capsule in the bottom and the top. And also, because we have the bassinet at the top, you can also purchase our click and go bassinet for the bottom. So you could have two lay flat solutions if required. What we really love about this inline, we call this, so uh, there's two different types of stadium seats. One which is the second seat is at the front and the other which is the second seat at the back. So we call this inline because it's in line with the top seat. And the benefit of this is as your child is getting older, they don't need the second seat all the time. So they can get in and out themselves. Oh, mum, my legs hurt. Oh, okay, just jump in there. Just do the buckle up. And then if they're in and out all the time, so you don't need to lift them up into that toddler seat and they can get in themselves, you know, have a bit of a rest and then they're like, oh no, I don't want to be here anymore and then they get out. <laughs> um, it's something that we all know that, that kids of that age at a toddler really want to be independent. So this is the kind of seat that allows them that independence, which is really great. Now, what you have in the tandem pack, and I'll just explain over here, we have the second seat, and what comes with the second seat is the seat extenders. So these are called seat extenders, and also these are mud guards. So these are what come to convert it into the second. I'm gonna take these products over to the, our single product with the capsule and just show you. So we'll just come over here. Now, because you need some extra space between the bottom seat and the top, what you need to do is take the capsule out. And you can see why these are called seat extenders, is you need to take this out, because that's for the click and go baby capsule. And then we're going to extend, so it pushes it further away, so you've got the second seat down here. We'll pop that in. Let's do it with the capsule in the top. And right, this way. All right, so that's the first bit. We'll put the capsule in. So sitting higher and further away from the second seat. Now, this is what's super easy. We've got the mud guards. All you have to do is just slide them on a little bracket. And that just helps to keep the second child really clear of the wheels. Pop the other side, and then all we do is push this basket forward so easy. And then all I'm going to do is drop this second seat into position. And you can see that's simple. Now, for those of you who aren't interested in a baby capsule, I'll take this out so you can see the top seat. I'm going to take the click and go adapters out. Trust me, with experience, you know exactly what you're doing. And then you've got your second seat. Now, most likely you're going to want that in parent facing if you've got a child that's younger age. So you can have this child in the lowest position lying down for their little nap because their legs are too tired. And then actually you tilt this, but you can actually position this so that there's a bit more space in there. If you were doing bassinet mode, you don't necessarily have to have, and we'll just recline this completely, and just adjust this to drop down. We can release this, but still have this up. So the legs being in a higher position, just to give this little one some extra room at the bottom is also okay. Because remember that in a capsule with the curved position is also suitable for newborn. All right, now, 
let's just turn this seat around so you can also see it in forward facing so I'm just going to click up that buckle really easy and then adjust that back rest and you can see this is such an easy product to use and that's what I love so much about it it really is super easy all right so one two v two now don't forget, put your comments in one of your favorite features of the 12V2. And I'm just gonna take you across to have a look at the accessories that we have sold separately. Now we have quite a few different accessories. It's really simple. Cup holder, I think we all know what that will do, but that's really great so that you can have a drink, um, pop a little drink bottle in the side of the stroller and we'll pop that on in a second. We also have our newborn and toddler comfort pack. Now this fabric is beautiful. It's made from a Thermo 5 and this Thermo 5 fabric is a, has wicking properties. So it's beautiful and soft to touch, but it also allows your child, it wicks away the sweat from the child keeping the child warm in winter and cool in summer it's reversible it has the same fabric as the bassinet liner both of these fabrics are also architects certified so to ensure confidence in the fabrics and the textiles that is on your newborn skin this little wedge would suit just the second seat to allow it in a more lay flat position if that's what you're looking for. And of course, the head pillow can be um, taken away for as they get older and you've just got a seat liner that makes it extra comfy and also protects the seat. We also have these click and go maxi cozy adapters. So that means that the 12V2 is also compatible with the maxi cozy Miko and the Nuna Click Plus. And we have a shade cover and a rain cover, which I'm gonna show you how to put onto the product. So if you come over with me. So we'll start with the shade cover. So a shade cover is really handy and especially we know um, if we're out walking a lot of mums what they do is they take the stroller and the baby shopping at the nap time. So keeping that environment nice and dark for the little one. It's really simple what we have is a bit of elastic and you pop that over the top. You've got toggle and elastic and we just do this wherever you find the most convenient but you just oh, just pop this here and maybe we'll do it around twice so that it doesn't flick away that's it and we do the same on the other side tuck this over here and I'll just quickly tie this so you get that nice taut finish so this is really great, UPF 50 plus protection. And what I love about the design of this is that we have quiet magnetic closures because it can get a bit warm in there. So this is really great for in the supermarket um, and a really hot sunny day. But then you can also, when you're not getting direct sun on your little baby, you can actually also open this up and then also has a double zip so that you can access your little one. Pop the little um, dummy back in their mouth when they're crying and then zip it back up. So that's the sunshade. Now I have our rain cover and we've specifically designed this because we have the tandem and single options. Now what we've just done is designed it so it can fit both. It's really simple. You've got the big, long, clear plastic section, which is down the bottom, so that the little one down the bottom can see through. We have air ventilation holes perforated in here so it doesn't get too hot. And then what you do is you just have Velcro there and you're just gonna line up this Velcro really simply like that on both sides and tuck this in like so. I'll just quickly do the Velcro up this side so you can see it. All right, now what we've also done is easy access for this as well, double zip. So you can change the position so you can easily access your little one without waking them up, having to take the whole thing off and then they get wet. Well, that's no good. So this is really about thinking about what you're gonna be doing and what you're going to need to do. 
So that's the rain cover. If you want it in single mode, it's super easy. You're just going to remove the Velcro. And then we have a zip here. Remove the zip. And the Velcro. And you can see that that is single mode. Really, really simple. So that's it for the 12V2. All I want to say is please contact one of our customer service team and really for those of you who can go and find a baby bunting store because this is the kind of product that you need to see. You need to be able to see and feel because it's so lightweight and compact and easy to maneuver. One of the main things that we designed about this product is knowing that you're going to have the two children in the seats is that we have also developed free glide wheel bearings. Now these wheel bearings are built into this pivot point here and they allow free movement of those front wheels so making it really smooth ride. So 12V2, really exciting to share this with you. Don't forget your chance to win one of your very own 12V2s. Just pop your comments in below. Um, tell us your favorite feature that I've taken you through. And um, yes, I wish you all the best of luck in um, winning one. And I just wanna thank for all of those of you who have joined us tonight. Thank you for listening. And yes, um, we look forward to seeing you at the next episode and good night.